Okay. We're back in Rivington. We gotta go back to the circus and trade in our clown body parts. I know that sounds weird. Because it is. It's really disgusting. But we have to do it. <clears throat> okay. go. This was fun when we first went to this circus and we were introduced to the doppelgangers. That was pretty neat. <clears throat> it just sucks. There's like no reason to come back here ever except for what we're doing right now. But you know, good thing we did it because we got the throwing spear. That's super duper good and that's now 100% Carlax build. again my vicious little warrior any luck finding dribbles there's every part of dribbles i could find oh perfection huh. this is just what i need his flesh has a few rat bites and his teeth are missing but these are minor issues i shall remake dribbles better than before Duh. Where once he was famous he will now become legend and you here, darling, a little something from your friend, Lucretius. My circus and I can now finally leave. The big circus, how are you going to get out of the city? It's called magic, darling. Do keep up. You're leaving right now? Not this instant. So should you wish for anything from my staff, be quick. Oh, and if you do take on the absolute, do try not to end up like poor dribbles. You are so very pretty after all. Okay, we got spell spell my gloves. When casting a spell that requires an attack roll, you take a negative five penalty to the roll to deal an additional die of damage. <clears throat> uh <clears throat> I have no idea if that's good or not. I literally have no clue if that's good or not. Thank you for fun. That's it. Wow. All right. Well, that was totally worth the time. Let me tell you guys. 100% worth the time. I don't know if those are any good or not. I don't even understand what, what that meant. So. <clears throat> Basically, you get a negative five to one roll, but then you get a bonus damage to another roll. That's all it says, right? It's kind of like sharpshooter. So it turns your spells into sharpshooter. They're less accurate, but you do more damage. Oh. Oh, that's interesting. Those are crazy for magic missile. Each missed its own roll and they hit 100%. That's true. There's no way that it can miss. So basically magic missile is super good with that and nothing else is. Yeah, basically magic missile would be crazy broken and nothing else would be good. Because magic missile cannot miss. But it makes magic missile super good. Right? Keep in mind, magic missile is so many hits that each hit's going to have that bonus damage as well. Right? Like, for example. Let's say you wanted to do a level a level seven, a level 5 magic missile. It's a guarantee of 2 to 5 damage, but it's adding a, a die roll of 8. So you could do 1 to 8 bonus damage for each hit of 7. So imagine if on average it doesn't add like three or four added damage times seven. So you're going to go from anywhere from 14 to 35 to like 50 to 80 damage on Magic Missile 5. So that's super good for Magic Missile. Everything else it's bad, but since you can't miss, it makes Magic Missile actually broken. It's basically, they should just call them Magic Missile Gloves, right? Then it would have been more accurate. Okay, we got to go north. I mean, that's a really good build. Like, imagine if you just, you, all you care about is Magic Missile. So you do things that buff your force damage, and then you use those gloves. And just do Magic Missile every turn. 
Does magic missile require an attack roll? I I don't know. I don't even know what that means. <laughs> Received, retrieve the do stolen gold from the Zent leader. We don't have it. We used it. What happens if we go there and we try to give it and we don't have it? What happens? <laughs> Who uses magic missile every turn though? But you would. That's the point. If magic missile now becomes your giant damage dealer and it's guaranteed to hit, why the hell wouldn't you be using it every turn? You would just spam that shit every fucking turn. The Noth Estate? Who the fuck is this? A good day to you, sir. I apologize, but Lady Janeth is not currently welcoming visitors. If you are here with regards to her recent marriage, you may leave any gifts or warm wishes with me, and I will ensure... This is the artist's quest? Oh! <clears throat> Forgive me. As you can hear, Lady Janeth is indisposed at present. Please come back another time. Everyone's saying just skip the quest. You plus words contain more truth than this human rhetoric. Speak plain. You've a quick ear for truth, scale friend. I'll not hide it from you. Lady Janeth wishes for some time alone with her new spouse and has sent her staff on holiday accordingly. Were you to try and enter, there'd be nothing I could do to stop you. After all, I am on holiday. Free the artist. I'm being told this quest is broken and the reward is useless and broken. Really? The quest is broken and the reward is broken. <clears throat> wow. This is the Lady Janath quest. It's another way to go in. You want to pick the pick the lock. Okay. Jeez, this city is so big. We still haven't been to this area either. Oh my god. <laughs> it's going to, there's a big bridge? What is going on over here? This is a dead end, correct? So this is the end of the map here. <clears throat> Down there is the stream. We've been to the other side. Right? Yeah, over here. So, okay, so this way. We already did House of Hope, Dr. Oink. Done. House of Grief? Greetings. Do you seek help? You are in the right place. Who the fuck is she talking to? We're over here. Who's this idiot? The House of Grief. The House of Grief well Welcome to the House of Grief. Or perhaps welcome is the wrong word, Shadowheart. <laughs> There's been some debate whether you'd even show up and face the consequences of your actions. I assumed you tried to flee, like a craven. Spare me your venom. I'm sure the Mother Superior will have plenty of her own. All in due time. <clears throat> Let us pass. As I said, in due time. First, you submit to the mapping of the heart. Only then... Can we know what is to be done with you? Mapping of the what? This is the house of grief. We strive to help those whose hearts have grown heavy. Be it with anger, melancholy, grief, or treachery. Submit to the mapping and reveal what lurks in your heart. If you consent, follow me. If you do not, Leave. Whatever. <laughs> Let's go. Out of the fucking way. What is this? Have a seat. The mapping will begin shortly. You seek to be unburdened, yes? The mapping of the heart can reveal the way. Yet, there is another here whose need is great. That voice. Allow me. 
I think I'm supposed to do this. Go ahead, let her do it. Do you know why you are here? There is something I lost. No. Had taken from me. My family. My life. I want it all back. Loss is a gift, girl. Do you still not understand that? Now give me the true answer. What is your purpose in being here? Going on is this part of the mapping? Who are- I'll remain silent. The artifact. I was sent <clears> to retrieve <throat> it. At any cost. And who tasked you with this mission? The Mother Superior. Of Sha- It's you. Give me the honor of my name. No. In full. I... I can't. My memories... I know what's in that head of yours better than you do, girl. My name. Mother Superior... Lyconia Devere. You still have the wits to recognize your betters. Good. You would have recognized your foul scent if he knows her for all this evil shot on incense. Always a pleasure to see old acquaintances, but you would be wise to not interfere in what is to come. Now descend. You have much to answer for. A ghost! <laughs> Wait, oh, a projection, says Boo. Uh, excuse me. A ghost! <laughs> a spooky ghost! I'll save. Dr. Oink did a super chat. Phil, I miss your Lies of P playthrough. Uh, it was great. I'm very much looking forward to uh, the expansion for Elden Ring. I think it's going to be a great playthrough. We haven't had any of that style of gameplay since Lies of P. I'm being told it's a Baldur's Gate 2 companion. Who is? <clears throat> Failed our investigation. Fail. Okay. Lyconia de Vere is from Baldur's Gate 2. The wall looks weird. Wait. Oyster of Somber Embrace. Welcome to the Cloister Cloister. Do, do, do. Another day, another Cloister Cloister. Cloister Cloister. Or to Legina's chest. The dark lady better than any arm. That's what they always told us. I think this was my favorite part. Putting these on, pretending to be someone else. I suppose that's been my. I, I, it's not working when I click. <clears throat> Oh, yay, yay. That's a shitty ass roll. Nice, second try. Cloister, cloister. Oh, the cloister. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's true. Darjax is better to get that on a chest than in combat. You're absolutely right. Oh, Cloister, Cloister, I can't get a 20 roll. Cloister! I got on that one. <clears throat> it's all junk. All this love in here is junk. Yeah, it all stinks. <laughs> Gotta get the Cloister, Cloister. I 
have hurt people here. Yeah. Did. Learned how to break the Fucked up bodies. interrogation room. Look. The spirit. Yep. Evil Not room. Oyster room. But it wasn't Oyster. always so. Cluster, cluster, cluster. Here, let's bring these to. Pick these up. Then maybe you could put. We can give that to um, Lazel. Like everyone has better camp clothes. Oh wait a minute, Lazel's in my party. Oh, everyone has better camp action. clothes except her. I want to put better clothes on her. Can't. Magnificently realized ensemble. That could be cool. We'll see what that looks like. It can't. Is pollen bad in my area? Why do I think post nasal drip is worse this week? Oh, it could be. It, I mean, it, it, we had heat for four days, and that made everything bloom and pollen and everything. So very much, my pollen output or the pollen output could be, you know, bothering me a ton. <clears throat> is this the cluster? Oh, I'm looking for the cluster, cluster. Go grind. Where are you hiding in the cluster? I, I want to know where you are, go grind. Are you hiding down here in the dark? Or are you still dead? Who the fuck are you? Is that gold grind? You're hey, not gold boy. grind. The mother superior is expecting you. You are sentry, Frederick. You are definitely not gold grind. <laughs> Go grind! What the fuck? Why the door close? I opened it. Probably gonna be a fight. It sure looks like it, doesn't it? We're gonna have to fight all these people. Wait, what happened? No father. Or you'll find yourself sporting a new hole in your torso. Who the fuck do you think you are, bitch? I'm gonna slap this dude around so hard. Drop him on his bald ass fucking head. No father. What the fuck? I'm trying to go the other way, dunce. Shut up. They're all dead. I'm killing them all. Every one of them is dead. They're all getting murdered. They already heard how you disgraced yourself before Lady Shah. How she marked you as the enemy. But it is quite another thing for them to see it for themselves. I am very glad you decided to return. A cautionary tale such as yours will be studied by Lady Shah's initiates for years to come. But perhaps I can make a case for some small measure of mercy. Give me the artifact, and I can at least make this quick. Enough. I don't answer to you. Not anymore. <laughs> I'm here for my family. That's right. I know what you did. And it's not going to be quick. This is your family. And now you have turned your back on it. The artifact was your last chance to prove yourself. And you squandered it. It has nothing to prove to the likes of you. This was a mistake. Why is the artifact so important to you? Let's ask. Whispers reached my ears from all corners. Potential rivals of Lady Shah, all vying for the same prize. A new god, amassing the disaffected, the outcasts. Those who should turn to us. This absolute is but an upstart. Disturbing the natural order and threatening to impede the glorious return of Lady Shah's pure, endless darkness. I had to act. I had to strangle that foul conspiracy while it was still in the cradle. We learned all we could. The artifact was the one thing the absolutists feared. The one thing they desperately wanted to keep out of their enemy's grasp. I had to have it. So, Dark Gaming says, like with Asterion, she was kind of evil in Baldur's Gate 2, so this is like if Asterion is in Baldur's Gate 4 as a bad guy. Okay. <clears throat> You thought you could beat the Absolute and the Githyanki? To fight so many foes openly could prove unwise. Shah's children are better deployed as daggers in the shadows, not massed upon a battlefield. So let the others fight while we wait. Once they are spent and bloodied from each other, we would slip in and take the prize. Alas, most of those I sent perished. All but one. I should thank you. If you hadn't sent me on that suicide mission, 
I'd never have learned the truth. You there! Surrender this You there! Now, and you can consider Lady Shah's forces your allies in the battles to come. Juicy G did a super chat. He says, why do you wear a toilet seat around your neck? Well, because my head is a big turd floating in the bowl. Of course, we all know this. I don't know how you don't, but this has been discussed many times before and we already know the answer. Thank you, Juicy G, for the super chat. <clears throat> okay. No, if you want the honest answer, it's a pair of neck phones, but it's not a toilet seat. She's all yours. <laughs> After all this, ah, she's all yours. All right, never, of course. As you <clears throat> like. Well, we have a lot of enemies to fight. That's for sure. I, I'm going to be honest with you. I wish I had Karlak for the fight. Because Karlak just throwing the spear and teleporting all over the room. Probably would have been much better than what we're doing right now. Because I don't know if... Like, I know for a fact that Lazel will be fine. But I'm a little nervous. I probably should have had Karlak in here, right? Um. Anyway. What do we go for first? I mean, we have so many enemies. Right? Nearby. So many effing enemies. Now remember, he has a great, a great attack now. Here we go. We're going to do... Range Dread Ambusher. I'm trying to figure out who, who can we kill. Turn one. This guy sadly has 150 HP, so we probably can't kill him. Damn, both of the ones who are first turn movers have a ton of HP. Maybe him. He only has 48. All right. Go for the eyes, boo. Go for the eyes. What the fuck? What happened? What the? It glitched. It totally glitched. Right? It definitely glitched there. It wasn't supposed to do that. Uh, all right. Range attack. Okay, so he's dead. And we still have another turn. Yeah, we still have an attack. <laughs> Double stab. No kill? Seriously? Ah, oh, I thought that would have killed her. She's bleeding now, though. Okay. How dare you? Nice. That was a good counterattack. Oh, what's he casting? Overwhelming grief. The Zishiar strikes at their foe's brain with pure malice, inflicting Call of the Dark Lady. It's level four. Oh, landscapers are outside. Well, hold on one second. Let me close the window. And, uh, and then we'll continue. I think I'm going to counterspell it. Yeah. Oh, landscapers tried to, to cast a distraction spell. All right, let's counter it. Nicely done. Fuck you. I am Lady <laughs> you Oh boy. The unknown father. Got fucking spirit wolves and shit. Ow. Ow. At least I'm dodged. This is a hell of a fight. There's so many enemies. Lady Shah's will shall be done. Sure. I should be summoning an angel with shadow heart. I have an angel. Huh? Remember the wolves that attacked Shah's parents? Yeah. So I guess or Shah's uh shadow heart's parents. Yeah. Well, we have many options here. Who do we attack? We can attack either of the Justiciars. We could go straight for her. If we kill her, do the wolves disappear? I wonder. Maybe I'll just try to kill a Justiciar first. 
So we're gonna do goading attack first. We can either do goading attack or we can do um Oh wait, we wanna do this all in. Wait, why isn't it oh it was, it was on! Oh we have the crazy soul breaker ability too. Or right, we wanna try to do either disarming attack or goading attack. Right? Throw the flask. Summon the beholder. Throw the flask now. <laughs> well, we have to go back. We have to wait for uh, Minz to do that. Trip attack as well. Oh, that's good too. Which Do I have the melee trip attack? Melee trip attack. Let's try trip attack. 75%. Oh, 94%. Do it on him then. Let my name be known. Yoink. But he saved. Son of a bitch. All right, we're gonna hit like seven turns, right? We are, we're gonna get like a ton of turns here. <clears throat> so we did trip attack, it didn't work. We tried trip attack again. Do I really wanna use all my superiority die now in one turn? I don't know if I wanna use them all, right? Fuck it, I'll do it again. Cap time, knocked him down. Obviously I wanna kill him, right? We wanna finish him. Here's the bonus attack you get as a great weapon master. So we should use the bonus action. And then maybe... Now, let's let's attack. Let's do a main hand attack to finish him. <laughs> fucking balls. That is fucking shit. Are you kidding? Alright, let's do our great weapon master bonus attack. He's done. Now, if we do action surge, we can keep going, right? And we can go for another trip attack or disarming attack, right? Okay, it worked. The trip worked. And now we get another bonus attack. Sweet. Uh, he's already tripped. Let's go for goading. Now let's just do regular. And I get another bonus attack. Now we're finally done. I could... <laughs> you could even have extra. You could do precision attack. Your next weapon attack will get an attack roll bonus, but then you're going to use a superiority roll. I don't want to use a superiority roll there. So... All right, so that we're done for her for that. We killed one. We've almost killed another, and they're on their ass. Okay. So now, I mean, we have so many options, right? I could do a giant area of effect. Oh, I know what I'm doing. Chain lightning. Dude, chain lightning is going to go ham here. Watch this. Right? I'm blinded though, but I don't think it matters. I have a 98% chance to hit, and that chain lightning is gonna fucking hit everybody, right? So let's do it. Chain lightning. What? What happened? It only. What? It didn't work. It didn't chain. These enemies are definitely close enough. And it didn't chain. Wait, it did? It just didn't show the effect. It hit them. It did hit them. It did. It didn't show the effect. What the hell? Why didn't it show the effect? That is so weird. <laughs> Sometimes this game is weird. I mean, yesterday, Shadowheart was invisible for the fucking Orin boss fight, right? I mean, I almost feel like I got robbed. I didn't get robbed, though. It worked. I just couldn't see it. How stupid. Anyway. Um, I mean, we have a couple options. We can restore a spell slot. We could do chain, chain lightning next turn. And I think that's kind of what I want to do. So let's just do this. This will restore the spell slot. And then we could do it again. And then I'm thinking I should... See, I don't want to be there. There's a darkness cloud here. 
But I don't really have a safe spot I can retreat to, honestly. Right? It did show the damage numbers on the wolves. It just didn't show the lightning effect. That's why I thought it missed. Well, that's stupid. Yeah, honestly, there's not really anywhere to hide. I guess I'll just stay where I am. Right? There's, like, nowhere I can really go right now. So. Okay. Um. Okay, he's casting Darkness, which is what? A level 1 spell? The level 2. Let's counterspell it. No Darkness for you, bitch. Almost Shadow Heart's turn. Now I'm blinded anyway. God damn it. You assholes. She's blinded, but she takes like one step out, she's not. So, okay, what we definitely should do is some kind of radiant attack area of effect here, right? Like this, or let's see. Divine Intervention, now. She's just not in a good position for Sunbeam. I, you know, this will be useful if we can use it, but she's just not in a good position for it at all. Our whole team's in the way, right? So, I'm probably gonna use Spirit Guardians and just start walking around and trying to hit everyone with it, but there's no guarantee we will, and this darkness is super fucking annoying, right? Dr. Oink, I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. He's like, summon, summon, summon what? What the fuck are you talking about? There's no summon. There's no summon. No one knows what you're talking about, man. No, I've got, um... What do you call it? I've got reviving the dead or whatever. This one. Animate dead, but there's no dead yet. So, I don't know what you're talking about. It isn't prepared. Yeah, I don't even know about any summon spell. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. She has a powerful level 12 summon. You don't have it equipped in her spell loadout. Oh, I didn't even know it existed. I had no idea it existed. Right? These are cantrips, right? I don't know what you're talking about. Planar ally? Was it this one? Planar ally? Maybe that's what you meant. Yeah, I don't have it. <laughs> I never said it. Yeah. Well, I don't have it, so forget that. I mean, I have different options. I could try, like, an insect cloud. Like I said, I could just go with, right now, spirit guardians, <clears throat> and then try to walk around. Yeah, I don't have it. I can't use it. I didn't even know about it, so I don't have it. If I do Spirit Guardians, it'll be good, but the problem is I need to move into range. So I could walk here, and it'll hit him, it'll hit the wolf, and this one, hopefully. And maybe this one, but that's about it. But then she's gonna be stuck in the, uh... <clears throat> she's gonna be stuck in the darkness, which sucks. Hmm. I'm just gonna use Spirit Guardians at this point. Level 5 and level 4. And I should just walk down into them and hopefully hit a few of them. Did it just clear the spell? I think it cleared the spell. I don't know why it cleared the spell, but it did. Yeah, because she's not blinded anymore. Huh. Cool. Alright. I broke the caster's concentration. Oh, cool. Well, that's good. Um. Now, what are my options? Well, I could cast Sanctuary on somebody who I think is in danger. 
Right now, Minsky's the one who's most in danger. Um, I could ca I could summon a spirit weapon to be distracting. I could do a group heal. With right now, we actually could all use the group heal. Maybe I'll do the group heal. Hmm. I don't have a speed potion. All my potions are on my main guy. That's not an option. Uh, yeah, I might do group heal. Mass healing ward. Because that's going to cast bless on everybody. Everyone's about to be blessed. Nice. Blade ward, blessing, everything. That was, that was very good. Alright, so now they're going to get... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. They're going to get 13 turns before I get to do anything. We have to hope that Minsk survives all of that. <laughs> 13 attack turns, right? By the way, I received a $15 tip from Asterian. Bazel for the win. I don't know. I think, honestly, I like I like Lazelle, but I think the Karlak build, where she's doing insane area of effect damage everywhere, is actually better. Because she could just toss that thing all over the screen, right? And teleport everywhere. I think she's better with that build. I think it's just a very unique build that makes her, like, so good. I think Karlak would have been much better for this fight. I didn't know it was going to be like this, right? All right, so I've received that tip that gets us to the Gunner Glasses goal for today. Mm. Okay. Oh, I'm, what am I doing? End the turn so they can do all their turns while I'm doing this shit, right? Do your 13 fucking turns, assholes. Sharon, novice of the Blue Nail. Girl of their darkness. The next thing I shall prevail. Lady Shaw's will shall be done. Her foes shall perish. The dark lady souls must die. Wow. Minsk took tons of damage, right? So, holy shit. We are completely surrounded. I definitely should kill this person standing next to me, right? But the thing is, if I double attack, I waste an attack. So, hmm. And that's it. It's all he could do. He was stuck and blinded, so he couldn't do anything effective. He's probably going to die this turn. <clears throat> Told ya. This sucks. 
However, she has that new buff. Remember when she's surrounded more, by more than one person, she does extra damage? Remember that? The attack one, she should do that spin. She has a spinning attack, right? Called cleave. Yes. Okay. Critical hit. Oh, I could do the unique soul breaker attack. And now I can kill her, I think. Pretty much. Done! Critical, critical hit. Wait, knocked out? Why was she knocked out? Nah, she's dead. It says she's knocked out, but she has zero HP. Does that not mean she's dead? I don't get it. Well, she's done. And by the way, the wolves didn't go away. Oh, plot. Oh, okay. All right, her turn's done. So I'm blinded. I have to step out of the blindness. Okay. Now I have to use Chain Lightning. For sure. I wish I could save Minsk, but I can't right now. I have to Chain Lightning these fuckers. Right? Wait. Arcane Battery. Your next spell doesn't cost a spell slot. So I should do this Chain Lightning and then double Chain Lightning. I really should. Right? Killed all of them. Now I should chain lightning to these. Yep. Wow, it didn't do much damage. It, it hurt them bad. These guys, like, got took nothing. Which is stupid. Chain Lightning was much better earlier. For some reason, now it's just not doing so well. I don't know why. Well, we killed as many as we could. Right? We killed as many as we could. Just get a little bit out of the way. Can I... I can't help him because I don't have an action. So, that's it. Alright. Thank you, Apostate Cantus, who became a member. Thank you so much. Darkness is a level 4. No, level 2. For your darkness bullshit. Rerun it. Indomitable. And it worked anyway. <laughs> I did it, I used it, and then it worked anyway. Which it wasn't supposed to. Yeah, look. Haunted by darkness. This wasn't supposed to happen. She has indomitable, which means it was supposed to not happen, and then it happened anyway. Look. Whenever you fail a saving throw, you can roll again using the new result, and then she failed anyway. So, amazing. Alright, Shadow Heart's turn. Now the question is, what the fuck do I do here, right? Like, I'm kind of in a big pro trouble here. I could try using, um, Sunbeam. That could be effective. I could try to revive him. 
but then he might die, right? I could heal. Like, I really don't know what to do here. I'm really at a loss for what I should do. Let me get out of... First of all, let me get out of the blindness. Oh, you fucker. Okay. Now, like, people are saying use group heal. That way he'll get up. Okay. I'm even gonna do, like, a really good one, I think. And I'll do a level four. Okay. Not that it matters. He's still... He's gonna get knocked down again. He only has 18, right? Alright, maybe I should use Sunbeam. Sunbeam will hit at least three. Depending on where I aim it, I can hit about three with Sunbeam. Yeah. I could walk her towards the enemies and get a few hits in with these, uh, whatchamacallums. Dead. Dead. Double kill. Oh, no, I don't want to do that. I want to walk. Okay. Got all the kits in. Right? Now. This will sunbeam one, two, three, four of them. Not bad. So I guess I'll go for the four. I'll go for the four of them. Killed another. This one has five, this one has eleven. So these are all about to die. All of them are about to die. Not bad. We've definitely reduced their numbers significantly, right? Okay. But now we have to survive one, two, three, four turns before Minsk even gets to move. And that's going to be a problem. I don't know what's going to happen here. Well, let's find out. Oh, you guys suck. They, got, they committed suicide. <laughs> Literally committed suicide. What the fuck? So he has no action because he just got revived. We could do offhand attack. That's about it. Yeah, that's it. That's all he can do. Guess I'll do it. My blade will be the decider of sides. Poked her. And that's it. He can't do anything else. He's probably going to die. Uh, excuse me. They love their blind bullshit. So. Man, I got some options here. We could run in and try to take out all three of them. I could run and try to take out this one. I have options. Hmm. I don't... I could go after <clears throat> this one, too. But then probably that's going to be the end of her turn. Right? This is your end. <laughs> okay. 5, 29... Just my look that her ranged is limited to 4 to 22 and that guy has 5. To watch him take 4 damage and not die, then I don't get my bonus turn. Right? <clears throat> nope, I got him. So... Now, 
worked. <clears throat> I don't have enough movement. Son of a bitch. That sucks. I lose my bonus attack. I lost my bonus attack. Yeah. <clears throat> Shit! So next turn, who's left? These two? This one. This one up here. There's someone else in the room. Right? Because I only see one, two, three, four left, but there's one, two, three, four, five enemies left. So... Oh no, there's only four. Oh, okay, we're good. There's only these four. Huh. <clears throat> yeah, I'm just, I guess I'm just gonna have Lazel self heal. And she can't do anything else of effectiveness. There you go. And what I'll do, I'll have her try to move up here. Because I think I'm gonna go after him next. I'm gonna go after this guy up there next, so. Never a dull moment. me everywhere. 44. Dang. Wanted to finish it. <clears throat> Let's just do it again. Got him! Nice. Very nice. So she literally walks out and walks back in. She hits them both. Uh. No. This guy doesn't get hit. I don't know why. That's weird. Not enough movement to cast a spell that she shouldn't have to move to cast. Right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she can't cast any spells because of the stupid darkness. And she doesn't have enough movement to get out now. This is dumb as shit. I hate this stupid shit. It's so stupid. I can't even Misty Step. They won't even let me use my Misty Step. Wow. Can't do anything effective. They just won't let me. They're a bunch of assholes. Yeah, she can't do anything. She has no abilities. That'll work because of the stupid darkness. <clears throat> Fuck this. Wasted my time. He killed himself. <laughs> you fucking idiot. He fucking killed himself. Why does the path is interrupt? What? Oh, because he, he can't do the attack because of the darkness cloud? Wow. Who is Die in silence, evil! <clears throat> oh, that was ranged. I guess I could do hamstring shot. He doesn't have any good ranged uh, special attacks. That's the problem. It 
worked? Yeah, it broke his concentration. Sweet. I probably should have cast that first, huh? Oops. Oh well. Bone chill is level what? It's a cantrip. Counter spells easily. Fuck that. Rigo, I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. I have two tips that came in during this fight, guys. So let me finish and then I will shout them out. Look at that. The darkness is gone. The darkness is completely gone. Only six. Only seven. Well, so much for peace. Torment. Oopsie poopsie. Going a little longer now. Save. Shout outs. Split the part. So, shout outs. I received a $5 tip from Snape Killed Dumbledore. Who we'll be using for the final battle? I don't know because I don't even know what the final battle is. I don't know. I Right now, I have different party options that are quite good. So. I don't really know what the optimal would be. I have to think about it, especially as we're getting closer to the end and we kind of figure out what the final battle is. Because at first I thought it was the Elder Brain, but maybe it's not. Maybe it's something else. Right? So this is that they're going to write in to stop Vlacketh after. Uh, I received a $15 tip from Asterion and the Sharon Broad. Phil, you get good loot. Well, I guess what you're saying is to kill her, right? Because I guess she was a character in a previous game. She had plot armor here. Well, you get to choose. Well, let's see what we do. <clears throat> so that's uh, 83 now. Thank you guys so much. And that was from Asterion again, by the way. All right. Good opportunity to split the part now that the fight is done. And come back and uh, get the spoils of war and go from there. Cool. All right. 